please be seated. You may continue. I want to go back to, to a few things, uh, investigate. One of the jurors would like to get your attention. I didn't know if it was possible in the future. It's like the interviews are a little hard to make out. I didn't know if it Okay, just so you know that that has come into evidence and you will be able to take it back with you into the jury room and you'll have a, a way to go ahead and play it. Okay, does that help? You. You're welcome. Thank you. Yes, you may. Uh, Investigator Serena, just to make it clear, uh, at about 52 minutes into that interview, the last one there on the 29th, you were playing the recording for Ms. Lauer, the screams for help, correct? You recall that? The 911, the 911 recording? Yes, I believe so. Okay, all right. And in terms of, uh, you were asking, in terms of who it was when he stated, that, is, that doesn't even sound like me. Do you recall that? Correct, yes. Okay. You were also um, referencing when you interviewed him in terms of that there's only three streets, and I'm referring now to state's exhibit number one. Um, in terms of retreat of Twin Lakes, there's three streets, is that correct? Yes, sir. There's Retreat View Circle that circles all the way around. And then there's the main one at, in, in terms of Twin Tree Lane that's right here. Goes all the way from the front entrance to the back entrance, correct? Correct. And then there's Long Oak Way. That's the third one right there, correct? Yes, sir. Okay. And finally, sir, uh, in your interview of the defendant, you showed him several photographs, including the photograph of the phone, the photograph of the victim, et cetera. Is that correct? Yes, sir, I did. Okay. If I may approach a witness, Your Honor. Thank you, me. State Exhibit 94. Is this one of the photographs you showed uh, the defendant? Yes, sir, I believe so. If I may publish that to the jury, Your Honor. Yes, you may. I'll oh, reject the at this point. I don't see any here or at the bench. Um, at the bench. 